hello agents welcome to another division video today i'm going to show you my last tenebre drop uh, tenebre can drop if you didn't know from any of the open world bosses and i will show you my last uh, drop gameplay right now after that you can see the weapon review and some gameplay at the end of this video where i'm doing some bosses with uh, tenebre uh, okay guys that's it for the part of the video uh, we will continue and check out this drop gameplay. Warning, now we're exiting the safe area. Okay guys, I will continue with my Tenebre weapon uh, review. Uh, let's check out the gun itself. This is how it looks. Uh, Tenebre is, as you all know, exotic marksman rifle and it is probably one of the division best marksman rifles for the PvE content of the game. Uh, Tenebre look is awesome. You can see the golden skin with some tiger stripes on this weapon right here. So uh, basically it is really awesome feeling when you uh, having a Tenebre drop. Uh, as you probably know, uh, Tenebre belongs to the family of the Scar Age variant rifles and uh, that is immediately telling you that this exotic weapon have definitely the highest damage potential when we are talking about the PV content of the division. Uh, high damage potential will definitely compensate relatively small magazine size which is 20 bullets by default. I had luck and I get the God Roll Tenebre in terms of headshot damage, which is in my case 171. Uh, I also got a lot of Tenebre rifles doing the open world bosses, but none of them has the headshot damage that high. Uh, about the RPM, usually Tenebre has uh, 275 RPM, which is in my case with the extended mag uh, and... Uh, I will show you... Uh, rate of fire uh, 288 uh, let's check out that headshot damage a uh, little bit more about uh, this particular tenebre I got in my last drop as I said it got 171 headshot damage uh, base damage on this rifle is 65.8k uh, RPM 275 and I got plus 13 with my extended mag also I got additional 22 bullets with the extended mag so it runs 42 bullets per mag uh, I think that's it for this part uh, I just want to show you my stash really quickly guys and you can see how many Tenebre uh, Marsman rifles I have already uh, I have one in my inventory and uh, let's check out the stash I'm showing you this guy not to brag about it but uh, just to uh, uh, make you see that by doing bosses you will get Tenebre pretty easy. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven Tenebre Master Rifle 
uh, plus one in inventory that's that is eight uh, okay uh, a little bit more about the weapon talents on my particular tenebre uh, I, I get uh, weapon talents like this uh, capable this is the first talent uh, using a skill improves the handling of your weapon for 15 seconds uh, what you can do if you have the similar weapon you can switch this talent for something more damage oriented and I will suggest to go with the brutal which will increase your headshot damage by 12% uh, brutal is the best uh, talent when we're talking about the marksman rifles sniper rifles so uh, if I want uh, to switch talent I will leave the middle talent and I will switch capable for brutal or competent or something like I said more uh, damage oriented uh, the second talent is harmful each hit has 15 chance to apply the bleed status effect to the target this talent goes hand in hand with my predator's mark build uh, because predator marks build will make your targets bleed uh, with every 10 uh, shots and with this talent uh, you will even improve your chances to apply the split status on the target so i will leave this like it is i will leave this talent if i'm going to switch talents i will switch capable for brutal probably and uh, let's talk about a little bit more about the uh, unique talent of tenebre uh, the tenebre unique talent is lights out well this weapon talent will reset your skill cooldowns and all the cooldowns of your group members when you shoot and destroy an enemy weak point uh, you can proc this talent once every 10 seconds and this talent is a great addition for every skill build uh, Tenebre will work great in any incursion, challenging mode or even legendary mode of the game. It is a great weapon for a team play activities uh, because it will reset all skill cooldowns for all of your team members. So, that, so basically that means that every 10 seconds you guys can pop booster shot, seeker mines, turrets, uh, pulse, uh, whatever, whatever you have equipped so this is pretty pretty uh, strong talent uh, if the team uh, knows wha what is doing uh, you should always have one uh, designated sniper rifle player and uh, if he using tenebre and he's good uh, shooter uh, all your skills will almost always be active the i can't stress enough how this is important if you playing group and or especially on the harder difficulty in the division uh, i hope you guys understand this what i wanted to say and uh, i will continue with the review uh, what else to say uh, tenebre even without this unique talent lights out is an awesome marksman rifle in a division if you want to play from the distance and headshot your targets it can be a great option so guys at the end of this review uh, there is uh, always a question is it worth to grind for in my opinion definitely yes okay guys that's it for a uh, weapon review and uh, tenebre drop uh, i hope you like this video uh, in the rest of the video uh, I will show you how I'm uh, doing Soreto, open world boss, it's a big cleaner boss. What I want you guys to notice in this gameplay is uh, skill cooldowns, actually reset of your skill cooldowns every time I shot the enemy weak point. Uh, that's it, uh, please comment as always like or subscribe if you find this video useful and i see you guys in the next video see you later guys
As you see, I pop my skill, and my skills are reset now. Okay, these are not the bosses, but it's a nice example. I hope you get it, guys. This is awesome example. Uh, let's go to Sareto. I will try to uh, make this even easier to see. They are all cleaners, so it should be the safe area. easy for example purposes, but we'll see. <laughs> One thing I know, this is awesome weapon, it look it looking great, uh, it's beautiful marksman rifle, and I hope you guys will get one. You just have to farm the buses. I will go from the back side. That way I will have more room to aim for a weak point of the cleaners I will uh, pop my skills and then watch out for the reset of the skills ok they are reset right I can pop them again ok those guys mean business Okay, my skills are reset again. Where is the boss? Okay, my skills are reset again. This all oh, get the hell out of here, man. It will burn you. Okay, my skills are reset again. Every 10 seconds, if you shoot the enemy in the weak point, you will reset your skills. Almost. I got to get rid of that pest here. Die. I'll try to hit once again they have two canisters these big bosses that's it and the skills reset again that's it guys I hope you like this part of the video I will continue with the weapon review of Tenebre uh, right now